The Spelman Museum actually started back in 2001. We used to have a really small conference room upstairs in City Hall. And we started because Mick Spellman donated a few of his family's artifacts to the museum to put on display. He kind of launched a, a drive to have local families donate some of their materials to the museum. Eventually we outgrew the space in the city hall and they did more space too. And when Mr. Spellman died, he left us a very generous endowment from his estate. And we used that to renovate these two historic buildings downtown. We renovated the buildings, we installed new exhibits, and now we have a big new space where we have lots more room to display and do events. We opened here in our new location in November of 2016. So we are the Spelman Museum of Forney history. We focus on Forney and Kaufman County, although we kind of do this region of North Texas generally. We started way back, we have some Native Americans, we have a teepee you know, set up in the front that you can see from the front windows, and we go roughly chronologically from when settlers first came to the area in about the 1840s, and then as we grew over time, agriculture, innovation, technology, developments. We stop in about the 1970s with our exhibits because Forney was founded in the 1870s, so it's kind of like the first 100 years of Forney history. We have some permanent displays that we have on one side of the museum with colorful murals and backgrounds. We also have a separate meeting space we call our multi-purpose room that has display cases that change a lot more often and that's where we have our board meetings and some other events. The Forney Historic Preservation League has a membership program. You can join either as an individual or as a business. We also have an endowment board that you can see in our front lobby. That's a one-time donation just to get your name up on the board, and those start as low as $25, but can go up to $50,000 or more if you're feeling generous. We're here Wednesday through Saturday. Every day we open at 11. Wednesday, Friday, and Saturday, we're here from 11 to 6 p.m. On Thursdays, we stay open a little bit late. We're here until 8 p.m. We try to include lots of interactive parts in our displays, so even young kids can participate in the museum experience. Some as simple as having a mural with different animals, and you have to try to pick out all the animals. We have a place where you can build your own log cabin out of Lincoln Logs. The blacksmith shop is interactive, trying to mix some of the tools with what they do. So we try to incorporate all kinds of learning levels um, in addition to the reading parts of the exhibit so that everybody can get a full experience. We do have a website at spellmanmuseum.com. We also are on Facebook, the Spellman Museum. We post some new events and exhibits that we have that go up, but we also post some of our historic photos. The Forney Historic Preservation League has a pretty big collection of Forney photos that go back to the 1800s. And those actually, those photos, a lot of them were the basis for our book, Forney Country, um, that was published in the late 1990s by the Preservation League. So that has lots of our photos and that book also served as the foundation for the exhibits in our museum. The museum is in downtown Forney, 200 South Bodark. We're just catty corner from City Hall.